Welcome to another episode of Landras. This week, as you can see behind me, we finally installed our solar panels onto our solar arch. We had to pull the whole boat out of the out of this um, workshop to get the solar arch back on. So if that's something you're interested in, stay tuned. If you're a fan, maybe head on over to our Patreon and support us. Buy us a beer. This is all our goodies here. The two solar panels. I've just come back from town. I bought two solar panels. 18 volt, 165 watt solar panel. So this is our project for this week. So let's see how much of this stuff we can work away onto the boat. See, we fitted now the, the panels, it's on the swivel base, so it could swivel down like that and up like this. Now I've got to make a, a little stay here from here. It's a fitting, camping fitting that they use in South Africa. I'm going to make a stay that goes up to the, the top one there. You can see that one there. I'm going to have it stay there to keep it up there. So by midday we'll have it up like this. In the mornings, if the sun is coming from that side, we can have it flattened at angles like that, so it matches the sun. In theory, so let's see if it works. Now I'll finish these clamps off here. I'm just going to take some of the burr, burr off there. Just clean it up a bit. And then uh, we're going to install it on the, on the solar, uh, on the solar arch. And let me show you what we've done. What we've done now is I've fitted the two brackets onto the solar panel. Hold it there, Tommy. So I've fit, fitted that fitted bracket on there and then the one at the bottom there. Fit it on that one there. Same with the other one. So now we're going to quickly put them on the arch. Now the two side panels are up. Now first of all we wanna I wanna just dry fit this. I wanna take the crane and lift it on top of the boat. See if it fits nicely before we put the top panel up. Do that uh, tomorrow. We'll try and get the boat out here. We wanna pull the boat out, but before we can do that we probably should clean underneath it. We're quickly going to hook up that fifth wheel uh, that um, we can pull the, the boat out of. Here 
here we have our block and tackle connected to the roof as soon as the boat's out in a second we're gonna hook the solar panel on it or the solar arch on it and then we're gonna lift it and drop it on the boat Here we've got our solar panels in place. You can see we've, we've fastened them, we've uh, sealed them as we did before. We also changed um, the fittings. Instead of having that caravan fitting, we added two fittings that have they just kind of hook in here so you can move it out to the side. That um, should be a bit more secure. And also on that side, because the, the problem with with these where the ball was just popping out sometimes um, now this will need a knock or something and because it has two it will need to knock both for the solar panel to drop next up is the connections so we've got two small solar panels on the side and we've got one big one in the middle the two small ones are for our 12 volt system they are connected in parallel uh, and we'll be going through deck fittings that we'll install in a bit through there and that'll power our VHF and our 12 volt electronics then the big one which is a 36 cell no, 72 cell 72 cell the two side ones are 36 cell a 72 cell uh, solar panel that will run through on the other side and connect to our house batteries so uh, I think we should have enough power we'll report back in a couple of weeks when we've actually had time to properly test it.
connections are complete. Uh, the big solar panel runs to the port side and the two smaller solar panels are running to the starboard side. So we just zip tie them in place here, I'll run it along the, the wire, along the pole here and then through the deck fittings down there. We decided to go with those deck fittings. Uh, we had these made up, but um, I think these are a little bit more waterproof on the side there. So, uh, yeah, now to test it. That's our episode. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next week. Buy us a beer.